I can't think of a greater honor than giving a lecture named after Nelson Mandela. I'm also thrilled that the theme of this lecture this year is living together. It's truly fitting because in many ways, living together was also the theme of Nelson Mandela's life. The number of young people dying from HIV has increased fourfold since 1990. We need to get people to get diagnosed. We need people to seek treatment. And people who are on treatment need to be fully adherent. There's always a question of how do you uplift people, uh, and the number one agent for uplifting people is the quality of the education system. And you know, so people have to look in this country, I'm not an expert again on it, but is the quality of education, starting with primary and then secondary and then tertiary, is it able to embrace in a high quality way the entire uh, citizenship So of the, the five billion uh, that we'll spend in Africa over the next five years, over two-thirds of that uh, will be related to those health initiatives. Uh, we are in some other areas of importance. I touched in the lecture on agriculture. Uh, we fund a lot of research in making better seeds, how we educate farmers, how we get better soil understanding, better credit to farmers. Uh, so that would be, after all, the health areas as a whole, agricultural would be the second. Uh, I also touched on digital financial inclusion. That's an area we invest a lot uh, to get the regulations so that the low cost fees and the flexibility of a digital financial platform becomes available throughout Africa. Thank you very much to all of you. Thank you.